And Mike Watson gonna take Sagat. Round one. Fight. So here we go, round one, as we are pretty far up here in the brackets for HDR. You get some like, nice, good old like fashioned. John Troy on this. Just you got, because I like John Troy on this match, just because he knows how to space his fireballs properly. Yeah, actually, he was demonstrating that just awesomely uh, against all of his opponents that we've seen so far. And, and, and that's what I was talking about. So I was saying, you know, like in the grand scheme of things, throwing a fireball is like the, you know, very simple in terms, but knowing exactly how far away from your opponent to throw that fireball is what it's all about. Uh, that's the difference between a winner or a loss. If right. You know how to space your fireballs properly. Uh, if he had guessed right on that, uh, John Troy would have lost a lot of energy. Oh, good move, good move. Um, and lower the game sounds just a tad, as we do have the first uh, the first match going to John Choi. Now, in that first round, he made it just look real easy. And now Mike Watson is going to make a character change over to Balrog. Uh, and uh, John Choi could easily just uh, pull it out right here. So this is going to be... Uh, an interesting matchup here is uh, I, he's obviously going to try to counter fireball spam as he does very well right there. Already has the health advantage. Got John Choi down. Just a sliver of help. And uh, there he's going to juke the fireball some more. But uh, John Choi knowing how to oh. keep his cool in a situation where he's got literally Lots no health patience. available. Yes. Very nicely done. And uh, goes oh. right through the... I cannot believe that John Choi could just so casually stay alive in, in a pressured situation like that. Mike Watson just looking for that final hit. Oh. John Choi still sent it out and very, very unsafe. Mike but, Watson uh, actually uh, played a smart move. He stood his ground and tried to anti-air him when he tried to jump. And, yes. Um, uh, what's it called it again? Uh, John Choi actually used his hurricane kick to get away. Ooh. Nice three hit there from John Choi. He's going to set oh, himself up to Dizzy. And uh, That's pretty much it. That, oh, and that is oh. it. I'll try to go for the cheese there. Uh, uh -oh. Play to win. Needs to, needs to block wow. so he doesn't get dizzy. All right, that's a good move. Good move. And there it is. That's going to be one round apiece. John Choi able to wrap it up right here. These matches do happen pretty quickly. Uh, but that's some old school, you know, ST or HDR oh, wow. as you're seeing it here. So Mike Watson wanting to tie it up here. Really important that he wins this round and forces it to a third set. Handling those fireballs really well in the first and second round. Uh, not able to advance oh, so sneaky. well here. Nice, oh, John Choi wow. getting That's aggressive. a lot of energy on the throw. Oh, good fake fireball. And uh, into oh, there smart. with the super, so nicely done. John Choi, one of the reasons why he's the best, as you see right there. That guy has an arcade stick and a box of Krispy Kreme donuts right there. <laughs>